Guys, I'm scared, but let's do it anyway. What? It's just a bathroom with a door opening, but hey! What was that? Ah, it's a demon! Get out of my bathroom! Ah! Too close, too close. Why are you creeping in my shower like that, bro? I gotta get clean. I just worked out. I'm sweaty, I'm smelly. Trust me, you don't wanna be in there with me. I am nasty. That's just creepy. I'm calling the cops. Good thing I have my bobas here to protect me from the demons in my shower. <laughs> Insane asylum patient recorded playing with his favorite puppet. That is so creepy. In 98, a year before I was born. Is he about to smack him? He looks like he's about to discipline that puppet. <laughs> like, don't you talk back to me. I'll give you something to cry about. And what is going on with this guy's hair? That puppet got something to talk about. It's like talking smack about Samantha liking her man's Instagram pic. That puppet got some sass. <laughs> And I am just casually joking about some really haunted stuff. <laughs> See, that's why I would be the first person to die in the scary movie. I'd be making jokes when it's not appropriate. This creepy video shows a group of British friends playing catch in a courtyard when one of them sees something terrifying. They don't look very terrified. Nah, that's just a Karen. About to call the cops on you for playing football. Not bothering anybody but her eyes. <laughs> She's like, I told y'all not to be playing out in public where it's legal. I don't like it. And then she's like, okay, I'ma I'm go away now. This clip shows a kid making a video for his school project when the camera catches something unexpected at the, the window. weenie dog. <laughs> Yo, someone watching you. Oh, that's creepy. The scary security footage from a driveway cam shows something crossing the road. For sure is not a human being. That's a demon. Just walking its dog. I mean, it's just minding its own business on a nice nightly stroll. There was one time I was brave enough to go out on a walk at night by myself. I know, not very smart, but it's actually kind of peaceful when you're not constantly thinking about how many people want to kill you. I never did it again because I was too scared afterwards. <laughs> but this demon just taking a nice walk on its own. Quit stalking it and let it relax. You know what? That might be me. <laughs> Video of haunted abandoned hospital. Why are you going in there? You know nothing good's gonna come out of it. This is way too creepy. Oh, uh, someone gonna pop up and I'm gonna scream like a little girl. Why are you in there causing trouble? See, it's stuff moving on its own. That's when you know it's time to go. Oh, uh, don't look. Quit investigating, that's why you're gonna die. Guys, don't go anywhere that's abandoned. One, it's haunted, you might get possessed or murdered by a homeless guy on drugs. And two, usually when something's abandoned, that means you are not allowed to legally trespass in there and you are probably breaking a law and you will get arrested if you're caught. <laughs> Toys caught in 4K. It's Toy Story, guys. I have never- Oh my god, that doll just looked at you funny. Y'all are caught! I knew they were real. He yelled, Andy's coming too late. See, this should have been the trailer for the new Buzz Lightyear movie that just came out. Which was actually pretty good. <laughs> Worst phobias to have. What? Oh! I don't like that. I'm not afraid of it but it's gross. Ooh, ladybugs, they're cute, but I don't want that many on my hand. That is camouflage. Ew, that looks poisonous. Okay, that I'm afraid of. That is an alien. I'm waiting for it to pounce. What was it called again? Entomophobia, fear of insects. That's not an insect, that's an alien. That's a different phobia. <laughs> Honey under a microscope. Oh my God, what's in it? Besides thousands of pounds of sugar. Oh my God, are those parasites? Ew! Oh, that's disgusting! I mean, if you eat candy, literally like 100% chance there is some kind of bug in it. I'm not even kidding, look it up. What your fears really mean. You're not afraid of the dark. Yes, I am. You're afraid of what's in it. Yeah, either way, stop it. You're not scared of being alone. You're scared of not being alone, exactly. 
Like, walking through the forest at night could be so peaceful if I didn't have that fear in the back of my head that something was watching me and about to kill me. <laughs> what is in this book? Is that a skull? Okay, that's some kind of witch's book of her spells for death, her hexes on people that cheated on her. Her high school bully gonna get it. Yeah, don't touch this book. You're probably gonna die. Just put it back where you found it. Or you know what, if you see something like that, don't touch it at all. That's like when they dig up this thousand year old mummy in Egypt and they open it like they're not about to release a curse on the world. You just leave it, you bury it back where it was, mind your business, and you won't get possessed. Simple. Have you ever seen this man in your dreams? Who? Okay, I have heard of this theory. There's like a drawing of his face where everyone swears they have seen this guy in their dreams or they actually know him, but he's not an actual person. Like there's no record of him actually existing, but everyone swears that they recognize him. I only recognize him from this actual theory. I've never seen him in my dreams or in real life. Comment below if you recognize this guy. <laughs> he's creepy and he kind of looks like a monkey. Insane Asylum Patient Room 203 Documentation of 1996. What is she doing? Looks like a mama disciplining her child. Oh, that's why you mind your business. See, if you hear something weird going on, you don't go investigate, otherwise, bam, dead. This woman like, what you looking at? You want some too? No, ma'am. No, I do not. Claustrophobia. Oh no. No. Y'all are crazy. How do you not have a panic attack in that situation? That is one of those caves where you have to like breathe out all of your air so you can actually physically fit through that crevice. And if you try to breathe, you're gonna get stuck and you're probably gonna freak out and die. And there's water, so he might go under and get stuck. Oh. Crazy white people, no thank you. Why do these guys always like try to put themselves in situations where they are more likely to die? Why, why do you want that? I'm comfortable not being in that situation. I like sitting in my comfy chair inside out of the deadly sun, knowing I'm safe and pale. Horror. I don't like where this is going. Oh. Do you have nothing better to do? Imagine you're on your lunch break in your car and in the car next to you, you see a guy doing this. Like, yeah, you look possessed. You look crazy. <laughs> Creepy animals you did not know existed. Ooh, that's, that's kind of cool. Oh, I hate that thing. No, it infected you. That is a blue fish. Well, obviously, but that's like the bluest fish I have ever seen. It blends in with the water. I want one. Can I buy one? But this thing is exactly how the zombie apocalypse is gonna start. That's how it infects you. That's a skinwalker. That's how it like absorbs you and like gets into your skin and then takes over your body and then it's over. Possessed voodoo doll dances on its own in the Philippines. Yeah, that's creepy. Oh, get away! That's like when the creepy kid asks you to dance at the school dance, and it's just like, sure. And then he does that. Like, that's why you don't have a girlfriend. You're kind of scary. Never say it's just one spider. Oh, no. If it jumps at the screen, I'm done. Oh, I hate this. Did you see that? There are like a hundred tiny spiders on that one Spider! Ah! I don't like this. So it's not just one spider. It's a million spiders that are really tiny. And they'll just like crawl in through your nose when you're sleeping and eat your brain. Ugh! One wrong step and your foot is gone. That's a giant clam. And they just, mm, whole foot gone. That is why a good rule of thumb is if you cannot see what is at the bottom of the water? Like, it's not clear, you don't know what's under there. Do not go in. There could be a crocodile, a giant clam, an evil mermaid, your stepdaddy that went out for milk and never came back. 
You never know. Things that are scarier at night. No, thank you. I never go in corn mazes. The thought of getting lost, just, mm -mm, I'm never doing it. Playgrounds. They are so gross. You know how many germs and kid poop is in there? Yeah, that's creepy. Face swap gone wrong. That is so weird. Oh, did you see that? There's something in your attic just waiting to get you. I just moved into this house with a friend and found this basement has a secret. They found a secret tunnel under this house. What is in there? Comment below what you think is hidden down there. But anyways, that's it for some creepy TikToks. If you blinked during this video, you probably missed it. <laughs> I hope you had your stuffed animals to comfort you because I did. As always, please subscribe, turn on notifications, follow me on social media, and I will see you tomorrow.